to, yeah. to get it down. <laughs> it was a great, a little, a little late, but I'm glad it showed up. Yeah. I'm glad it showed up. It, it was nice to see everybody contribute in a way. I thought Peyton's minutes were outstanding. It was his first start in a long time too, and he really played well. He was dialing in. Um, again, you know, Tony maybe in December missing some shots could have affected him. He was not affected at all. He did a masterful job of running our offense, of being patient, of getting everybody involved, and his defense has really improved. He wanted to guard Watson, which was everything to me. Cool. You getting an ice tub now too? I'm getting something. I'll tell you. That. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. Patrick, you told us that you know you have to earn it to have the ball bounce bounce the way. How did you guys earn it today? Well, you saw some of those some of the uh, rebounds bounce our way in overtime. I don't think I've seen such good bounces that way in, in, in the past or this year down the stretch in February, March. So it was nice to see. I think they earned the right. They earned the right to make those shots. They earned the right for those stops and rebounds. Mike continues to work hard. And as long as we have that great mindset, you know, hopefully we continue on this path. Mike Watkins just in beast mode, taking control of the defense. What did you see from him today? He's got a beast mode <laughs> um, He had such a, you know, a desire today. I'll say desire. Uh, he was so focused. He knew exactly how he was going to go out and compete. He bought into the game plan since, since Monday. That kid is absolutely invested in, in Penn State basketball, and I think that's what you saw today. In the locker room, I asked them kind of where that laser focus came from, and they all said that the week of practice was just absolutely one of the hardest weeks of practice. What did you kind of put together leading up to this game? I can't re re reveal everything. <laughs> I can't reveal everything here. No, we had a good practice. Short and hard. We went old school a little bit. A little dive drill, a little charge drill. Keep everybody on their toes. A little bit of October practice. But you know what? They asked for it. They wanted it. They said we got to go back a little bit to get our roots and find our identity. We found our identity today. And my last question, how do you keep this momentum rolling? You know what? We're going to do what we're supposed to do. I'm going to do my job. My staff's going to do their job, get ready for Michigan State. Our guys are going to get back. They're going to do what they're supposed to do, cold tubs, eat, you know, rest up, and then we'll get ready for 930. We'll watch that scout film. Watson hits the three. What goes through your head? A minute, 56 seconds, whatever it was. You know, I was just like, you know, here it is again. And we, we got to be able to get stops. And then at that point, I was just thinking about what I was going to run. I knew I still had a timeout. They were playing 1-3-1, one, one, so I had two plays in my head. So, you know, I was really, I moved on, which maybe in years past, I would have let that hold me back. But it didn't hold me back, so I've been through those experiences as well with this team. So now I knew, move on, get past it. Difficult shot, difficult shot. I mean, Tony was right there. Tony's 6'4", and Watson's only about six foot. So I was moving on quickly. And then you give the ball to Tony with 11 seconds. Yeah. He gets in the lane. Was that you were hoping for a foul? I was hoping that he was going to get himself to the free throw line. I had moved him around the entire second half. One block to the other block, uh, ball screens on each side. We just kept moving around. I knew he was going to make good decisions or get himself to the free throw line. And you know what? I thought he may have gotten tripped, but they, you know, I talked to Rob. He said, nah, I didn't get tripped. He kind of hesitated, <laughs> kind of stumbled. And you know what? I got to respect the ref. And, I said, All right, fine. and then free throws kind of hurt you a little bit in regulation, but in overtime. Made our free throws in overtime. Tony, oh, sorry. I don't know if you have to, sorry, no. uh, Tony also mentioned the uh, getting the ball to bounce your way, uh, you know, today for at least the first time in a while. You know, with having a young team with a lot of freshmen, how does that kind of how do you see that affect them when you're going to get some bounces? That well, you, you earn hard. the right for bounces. You earn the right. Um, when you play hard and you're committed and you're two feet in, you earn the right for those bounces to go your way. And, and you know what? For whatever reason, the ball wasn't bouncing our way some games. But today, you know, we got we got some luck on our side, so it was nice. And you know what that does? It gives our team confidence. Thank you.